Hello everyone, in today's video, we'll check out the game console in the market. The game console I listed here are recommended by the reviewers and have lots of positive feedback from the actual users, so if you're looking for the best one for you that is worth your money then keep watching this video I guarantee you'll find the best and suitable one for you from this list. One more thing please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and check the links in the description. Okay, let's start with the video. At the first position of our list, we have Xbox Series S. The major advantage the Xbox Series S console has over nearly every other new console on the market is that it isn't sold out. Unlike with the PS5 and Xbox Series X, you have a good chance of purchasing an Xbox Series S console for its very affordable market. Combine its low price with an Xbox Game Pass subscription, and the Xbox Series S console offers perhaps the best value of any console, although it's less powerful than its Series X and PS5 brethren. The Series S delivers an easy, convenient gaming experience for users not chasing cutting-edge performance. It runs games at 1080p and 1440p resolutions wonderfully, and as long as you don't mind its discless form factor, it makes for a great console for most gamers. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Nintendo Switch. Riding the line between current generation and last generation is the ever-popular Nintendo Switch. By far the best-selling console between Nintendo. Microsoft, and Sony, the Nintendo Switch distinguishes itself in two ways, through its unique form factor and excellent library of ex The Switch is designed as a hybrid console, one you can just as easily enjoy at home or on the go. Its hybrid design also extends the controller, able to split in half easily to instantly accommodate two-player gaming sessions. Overall, its design works amazingly well. On the game side, the Nintendo Switch has the most exciting library of games by far. With dozens of exclusive critically acclaimed titles like Animal Crossing, New Horizons, Mario Odyssey, The Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wild, Super Smash Bros., Ultimate, Fire Emblem, Three Houses, and so much more, it's worth getting a Switch system for the games alone. The number 3 position is held by Nintendo Switch Lite. The Nintendo Switch Lite is essentially a travel-focused version of the original Nintendo Switch. The main difference between the two is that the Switch Lite cannot be connected to a TV or monitor. The only mode of play available is handheld. In addition, the Joy-Con controllers cannot be removed from the console, meaning no spontaneous multiplayer sessions. However, for gamers specifically looking to enjoy their games on the go, the Switch Lite is an enticing option. It can play nearly all the same amazing games the original Switch can, has only slightly less battery life, and is available at a significantly cheaper price point. If gaming on the go is your top priority, the Switch Lite is the console for you. Next at number 4 we have Nintendo Switch OLED model. The newest addition to the Nintendo Switch console family, the Switch OLED is a small but noticeable improvement over the original Switch for a small bump in price. The main changes to the screen, the Switch OLED houses a vivid 7-inch OLED display, compared with the original Switch's smaller LCD display. Handheld gaming really pops on the Switch OLED. Other changes are mostly to the design, with the OLED housing improved speakers, a much better kickstand, and an Ethernet port on the docking tray. It also has 64 GB of internal storage, compared to the original Switch's 32. Overall, the Switch OLED is a great choice for fans of Nintendo who will be spending a lot of time gaming. The number 5 position is held by Sega Genesis Mini Genesis. There have been a slew of retro throwback consoles released as of late. From Nintendo's NES and Super NES Classic to Sony's miniature PlayStation Classic. Retro gaming is having a serious moment, but the most well-executed retro home console might be the Sega Genesis Mini. With 40 preloaded games including hits like Sonic the Hedgehog 2, Fantasy Star Roman 4, and Street Fighter 2, the Genesis Mini offers the chance to enjoy a wide variety of classic titles. The design is also a wonderful recreation of the original console, with attention to detail throughout. Just don't expect it to outperform any modern-day console. The number 6 position is dominated by Xbox Series The Xbox Series X is Microsoft's answer to next-gen gaming, offering the same fork at 120 performance with ray tracing, high-quality textures, and improved particle effects as the PS5, and although not quite as fast as Sony's bespoke SSD, the inclusion of an SSD means game. There's a large library of games available to play, offering backward compatibility all the way back to the original Xbox something that the PS5 can't quite compete with, only offering compatibility with PS4 titles outside of its PS Now service. The design is much more muted than the competition, 
sporting an all-black design with green highlights within the vent atop the console, but it still stands tall at Thirticum. Moving on to the next at number 7 with PlayStation 4 Slim Want console. The PS4 Slim is pretty much exactly what it says on the tin, a smaller version of the original PS4 and a smaller, more rounded design. And with the launch of the PS5, it's cheaper than ever. With a library of games at your fingertips and releases continuing for some time, there's no better time to get your hands on a PS4 Slim. Existing PS4 owners won't need to upgrade as the internals are almost identical. Although the new Slim PS4 has HDR support, that isn't exclusive as it's also been introduced to the launch PS4 with a software update. The number 8 position is held by NVIDIA Shield TV. 2019. The NVIDIA Shield TV may seem expensive for a media streamer, but the games available on Google Play on the system are fairly cheap and there's plenty more on offer too. While the Shield offers all the same features that a standard media streamer would, it also offers a number of Shield exclusive games that are pretty power intensive, and it offers support for a range of Bluetooth controllers too. It also boasts an exclusive subscription service that provides you with a vast library of games to play, and you also have the option to buy the latest PC games to play directly on the Shield via GeForce Now, too. Next at number 9 we have PlayStation 5 console. The PlayStation 5 came out in late 2020, and it's every bit as hard to find in stores as it was a year ago a sign that it is living up to the hype. The console is optimized for 4K TVS, and has a powerful, fast processor for smooth play on visually stunning games, but it also has backward capability for older PlayStation. Players love the way the triggers simulate the feel of whatever they're supposed to be in gameplay, and the controller vibrates with the action, too. A built-in microphone in the controllers encourages more interaction in multiplayer games, Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Sony PlayStation 4 Slim or Pro. With PS5 still so hard to acquire, you'll be pleased to know that the one PlayStation 4 Slim and PlayStation 4 Pro, best for fork consoles, are still available. Though they're not the hot new thing, PS4 games are still some of the best. Tweens, teens, and experienced gamers alike will get lost in games such as LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2 and SteamWorld Dig 2, both rated for every 110 plus, and when game time is over. The whole family can join in the fun the console doubles as the ultimate entertainment center thanks to the PlayStation Store streaming services, which includes newly released movies, Spotify music, and even your favorite TV channels. Bonus! Parental controls allow you to decide if you want kids to use online features, set spending limits on your account wallet, and more. That's all for today. We upload tech product review videos every single day. so. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.